Are you... Are you kidding me? And welcome back to yet another Buffalo Bills pregame. Uh, I think the top story right off the bat is... What can we do to Miami in December to make them as uncomfortable in the stadium as possible? If they can have a shade so they can be comfortable on the sidelines, is there anyone going to like, direct the wind to the north side of the stadium? If possible, I mean, we got to do something. Something to block the wind on our side. Try to explain to like a fifth grader why the Bills are not allowed to be in the shade when Miami was. Uh, it just it doesn't seem fair. Um, Welcome to Buffalo Bills pregame. I'm Randy. He's Dan. I just had to get that out. I don't know how the NFL corrects us, but uh, what the Miami did to our players, brutal. Uh, as such, we are the first ever giving you the healthy report. Here's the healthy players for the team. Uh, we have Allen, Singletary, Diggs, Dawkins, Saffold, Jones, Russo, Miller, Edmonds, Milano, Johnson, and they're all just fine, uh, which means that there's a lot of people injured. Um, I don't know, Dan. What? what what injuries are perhaps the biggest concern to you going into week four? I mean, the offensive line being depleted is certainly not going to help. Um, you know, hopefully we get Poyer back this upcoming Sunday against the Ravens. Um, but, you know, the secondary didn't look too bad uh, against the Dolphins, but, uh, you know, hopefully we can get some of them back. Um, and uh, the offensive line, I think, is definitely the biggest thing right now. Uh, Tredavious White might be able to go as soon as this week. Uh, possibly I'd rather him wait until he's all the way healthy. Um, but, yes. Hoping people return back from injury is where a lot of the hopes of Bills fans are uh, this week. After a, a hot start to the season and a loss to Miami, there's reminiscence of previous seasons, especially 2003, with a Week 3 loss to Miami. Um, do you think it's just the comfort zone of Bills fans to go into panic mode, or a 2-1 and one and all these injuries, is there a reason to be concerned right now? You know, for a while... Starting in uh, 2017, 2019, even uh, you know when the Bills were starting to look pretty good, uh, I was in the panic mode, panic button all the time. Uh, you know, just not being used to them. I'm at the point now where I I trust the Bills. I think they have a lot more talent than the 2003 and 2011 teams. I um, mean, you know, it's early on. The Dolphins look pretty good, and uh, you know I'm definitely not worried right now. Um, the Ravens, to look on the other side of the ball, uh, have been playing excellent football. Uh, it would seem that they are just rolling through teams, but two of those teams are the Jets and the Patriots, who might not be good at all. Uh, do you think the Ravens are just overcoming bad competition, or are they what they look like they are? Uh, I think the Ravens are definitely a top team in the AFC. Um, you know, definitely. They had a loss a close game to the Dolphins. I still think they are a better team than the Dolphins. Um, you know, I guess it's hard to say that after they lost to them, but... Um, no, I definitely think they're a pretty legitimate team to be looking to play. Um, Josh's first game was actually against the Ravens in a 47-3 loss in his rookie season. This is his first time returning to Baltimore ever since then. was also, uh, also Lamar Jackson's first game. Um, do you think that they've – have they progressed equally? Has one outpaced the other? Uh, what are your opinions in terms of the matchup coming back to play each other in Baltimore for the first time since that first game together? I think they both definitely come a really long way. Um, you know, for two of the probably most questioned quarterbacks coming out of the draft that year, um, they're certainly the two of the best. Um, you know, obviously Baker Mayfield, Sam Darnold, Josh Rosen are definitely not compared to what they've been doing. Um, so they've definitely come a long way. Um, I think they're both really talented um, in different ways. I think that they're two of the top uh, quarterbacks in the league, though. Uh, Flacco and Pat Peterman, where are they now? The, the starting quarterbacks from that season, huh? Um, on the offensive side of the ball for the Bills, a um, lot of injuries on the offensive line, uh, struggling to get the running game going. What do you think the Bills need to focus on to be moving the ball this week? I think they definitely showed how incompetent they are running the ball against the Dolphins. Um, I think Josh Allen had around like 60 passes or something. Um, so that's clearly not a good sign this early on in the season. I think Singletary has definitely shown that he clearly should be the number one back, um, and James looked has looked James Cook, excuse me, has uh, looked pretty decent as well against the Dolphins. Um, so, I mean, I, I would try and get the running game going, but at the same time, I see how it would be easy to abandon the run if it's not working and you have Josh Allen at quarterback. Uh, on the other side of the ball, Lamar Jackson in a 
uh, contract year, and it looks like he's playing for it. He's won my fantasy team a few few games already. Uh, what do we have to do to with all the injuries in the secondary, especially, to slow him down? I mean, with the way the Ravens have been scoring this year, you know, hopefully we can get some pieces back on the offense, and who knows? I think it'll be a shootout personally. Um, but um, yeah, I think if hopefully if we can get Poyer back, that'll uh, take away the deep throw a little bit. All right. Well, you think it's gonna be a shootout? I think it's gonna be a, a thirty to twenty-seven game with Bills pulling out a close one. What's your pick for this week's game? Uh, you know, I think I think I have to do it. I think the Raven. I'm gonna say Ravens thirty-eight thirty-five. Oh, all right. Well, I'm glad I got to go first this time. <laughs> well, we'll be back for yet another Buffalo Bills game. Each and every week, we have content coming for you. Hope you're enjoying it as much as you are. We got the Super Bowl season coming up. We're still excited. Go Bills! Oh, I didn't hit record. Are you? No, I didn't. Are you kidding me? I'll check it out, I did. Never mind. <laughs>